Late this afternoon, Joan Cunningham asked the court for forgiveness and said she too is a victim. She said she loved AJ, her five-year-old son, whom she admits murdering. CBS 2's Dana Kosloff is live at the McHenry County Courthouse, and Dana Joanne called herself a loving, kind woman. Yeah, Erica and Brad, she also told the judge she could not justify anything she has done. That in her eight-minute elocution to the man who now will decide her fate. I would give my life to have AJ back. This is something I will never escape from. I am impacted forever by my horrendous choices. Joanne Cunningham speaking to the judge at the end of her sentencing hearing today. Emotional, remorseful, a far different demeanor now. All of my children are sacred. Than 15 months ago. Dear father, please make sure you save them. That's AJ Friend's mom, Joanne Cunningham, moments before a Crystal Lake detective interviews her about her missing five-year-old son in April 2019. You have nothing to do with this, correct? Absolutely not. No. Okay. That turned out to be a lie after AJ's father, Andrew Friend, ultimately led police to the little boy's shallow grave. It was just some of the evidence and testimony presented at Cunningham's sentencing hearing. She switched her murder plea to guilty from not guilty in December. Did you make any observations about about AJ. I did. What so, did you observe? Back into the kitchen, um, AJ had walked into um, where I was standing. There's a kitchen island in the kitchen, and he had come from like the living room area. And as he came through, I noticed a large bruise on his side. That testimony about one of several police visits to the family's Crystal Lake home prior to AJ's murder, which exhibited clear signs of abuse, drugs, and neglect. Prosecutors showed pictures from inside the cluttered, dirty home, including some of AJ's crib in a filthy room with a padlock on the door to lock him inside. And they played video and audio from Cunningham's own cell phone. One was her berating AJ about going to the bathroom a month before she killed him. Do you swear on this family, yes or no? Um, I do. Okay, awesome. What is this? What are those? Uh, that's from this. From the paper towel thing. This is from... No, this is... That's from piss. At times, a significantly heavier Cunningham looked down and wiped away tears. Another cell phone audio exchange between Cunningham and AJ just two and a half weeks before his death also clearly upset others in the courtroom. I just don't want to fail with me, and I want to have one. Very difficult to listen to for many of those in the courtroom. Now, prosecutors here in McHenry County have asked for the maximum 60-year sentence. Joanne Cunningham will be sentenced tomorrow afternoon at 1.30. As for AJ's father, Andrew Friend, he pled not guilty, and he waived his right to a jury trial, though a date for a bench trial has not been set. We're live outside the McHenry County Courthouse in Woodstock. Dana Kozlov, CBS2 News.